Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here then hi I'm Sam and through the month of December I am putting out a video every single day, hopefully. <laughs> um, I do have chronic illness so obviously sometimes there may be days where it doesn't get out but today I thought we would do like a what I've been buying recently because with it being Christmas and stuff, buying bits and pieces from here and there that they've not really had their own like haul type video so I just thought we would do a generalised what I've been buying. So I bought these today, Ta -da! these are the Fabulosa Foam Fresh, Freshener is the word I was looking for and these go on carpets, expulsory, room freshener, how do you use them as a room freshener because they're like, so these are like, let me just grab it, so these are like 101 but they are in the Fabulosa range. So I bought Gold Touch and I've bought the Wild Rhubarb. This smells like the Method Wild Rhubarb like spray that you use on the sides. Um, so I can't wait to try these out. They're 179 and I got them in um, Pound Stretchy. They also nipped into Pound... No, I did nip into Poundland but I didn't get anything excited. I got some confetti filled balloons because of itself is Dylan's birthday on Christmas day. I got another little can of snow spray for something I'm doing and I picked these up there. So they're just little, a 10 pack of little glittered snowflakes and the glitter is getting everywhere while they're still in the packet. Um, I nipped in through Primark, you won't know, I'm thinking you'll know where I'm going but obviously if you're not from Preston you won't know that Poundland and Primark are on near each other. But I picked up some bits in the sales. So they've got quite a few bits of different things knocked down in price. So this was 2 50 down to a pound. Now, I really don't like slime in my house, but this is actually bath and shower gel, but in a slime version. And I thought Alfie would find that absolutely hilarious and perfect for like a stocking stuffer. I then picked up a few little bits that I'm going to give to my friend to give to her little girl because we're not buying for the kids this year, we're buying for each other and um, that way I think kids get a lot at Christmas and us adults don't, we don't spend as much on like, if I was buying for the kids I'd buy more for the kids than I would buy for her so we've decided just to buy for each other but I couldn't not pick these up for her because they were all down to 50p so I've got a little Christmas unicorn lip balm and I got a little Disney um, Lion King lip balm for 50p and I also picked these up so these are children's little press on nails and they have Mickey and Minnie Mouse and then they have Daisy Duck on there and some little colourful ones but for 50p I thought they were great for her to be able to put in her stuff, stuff stuffing stuck it oh my giddy aunt can you tell it's towards the end of the day my fatigue gets worse towards the end of the day, which is why I don't tend to film videos because I struggle more and more with my speech as I get towards the end of the day. Um, so I am sorry for that. But I also picked this up. Now this is a From Santa to me because obviously Santa in our house brings all presents. Um, I know everybody does things differently and that's absolutely fine, but I've just always done it the way my mum and dad did it for me and that was Santa brings everything. But obviously I do buy a few things from Santa to me so that um, the Alfie doesn't feel like I've been left out um, but I picked this up it's a bigger backpack let me just oh I haven't got my backpack oh leading on from this I was going to show this other backpack from Primark so this is like the normal size that I carry and this one is a lot bigger this would be perfect actually for school kids for their backpacks it was down to three pound from from 12 I think it says 12 but it's in a euro so it may be 10-ish but it's down to three pound anyway and it's massive um and I got that today so but I have picked up this one recently and this one was in the sale from 10 down to five and it's like a little suede one I love my backpacks I can't wear handbags not to go out shopping and stuff with um crossbody hurts my shoulder too much so I've gone moved over to backpacks so I picked obviously they're perfect for me so a few things that I picked up for Dylan, I have actually blocked his channel so that he can't see this video. Um, I picked him up another pair of pyjamas from Primark. What else have I got? I don't think I've got anything else from Primark for him. 
but I did pick up, I have, oh, I've not just knocked you out of the way, I'm trying to get my bag to me. I have picked up a few things from there. Oh, I think I caught, I think I did these in a haul recently. Um, so they're for me from Santa. But some other things that I've been picking up, um, there's these ones are off Amazon and I thought my door was shut. It is now. Um, <laughs> this is, I asked my brother to help me with this. So this is a gaming headset and it's compatible with PCs, Macs, PlayStation 4, Xbox One, Nintendo Switch and mobile devices. So it's one that will go right across the board. Um, but we bought this one. I'm sure this one is the one, when we was looking at them, that the little microphone bit comes out so you can use it as a headset as well um, but yeah I will link things like this that I can link down below in the comments for you because um, a few things I did pick up on Black Friday but you may still be able to get them I got him a pair of Bluetooth headsets because his new phone that he'll get for Christmas um, doesn't have a jack um, for headphones it just has they ha need to have the same as our C type charger so I thought we'll get them a pair of Bluetooth ones and they will be great because we won't need to plug them in what else have I picked up recently in the sales and stuff um, I now can't remember what I've shown and what I've not shown but if I didn't I picked up one of these to go with my coats because of my other scarves don't colour wise go Something else I picked up in the sale was this bad boy. Um, I've always wanted a curling wand that's got a wider barrel so that I can just add, it's a bit short mine at the minute, but when it grows a little bit longer, to add some loose waves in. So um, I picked this up. This was only about £20. Um, it was a right little bargain, and so I picked that up. I have seen, which I'll link down below on Amazon, they are the hair dryer ones that have got brush built in that are really popular at the moment and I am thinking about getting my mum one because she would really benefit from it because um, of it's like there's no brush and a hairdryer. What else have we got in this big bag in here? Something else, I can show this in case even if my dad and his um, wife watch, they asked for some of this. So this is Bulldog Gin and apparently it's a really really nice one but not it's not as easy to find. Um, so I picked this up for them for Christmas and I have got another little gin gift but I'm not showing that one because of um, just in case they do watch for some weird reason. Something else I picked up for Dylan was this one which is Jenga Monopoly. Now he loves Monopoly, he actually collects the different board games like the different versions and um, we have so many versions of Monopoly in this house but I thought this one would be actually fun and also play that Alfie may be able to play along once I've read the rules um, because I think you have to try and get your colour of street out which would make it really funky but I got this from Smith's I think it was about £12 which obviously isn't that badly priced really something else I've been picking I bought from eBay came the other day and these are the little flower boxes but I'm actually going to make the chocolate bouquets um, and I'm going to, I'm just waiting for the chocolates to arrive that I've ordered and I will show you how I make these because I think they're going to make a really cheap but like wow kind of gift and um, those were on an offer if you bought five I think it was that you got a certain percentage off so if you can find those I will link them down below what else have we got in this bag? Da -da -da. Uh, I picked up some stock, stocking stuffer type stuff for Dylan. Um, he loves these types of pens. We do try and get like all different varieties of them. We've got the ones with the pencils in and things before. A packet of little, we like playing cards. So these are like money cards. But they've still got like the, the king and queen and, and whatever else on. But again, a little stocking idea because Dylan is so hard to buy for. So hard. What else is in here? Just trying to look now. I'm trying to think what else I've bought for me. I've got him some couple of little bits of clothing, like joggers and bits and pieces. I do want to get him some new hoodies. Um, but else is in here. I bought these recently for my little stocking. 
these are keratin hair masks from Primark and they're 60p. Now these are quite hard to get hold of because they fly out the shelves and there is a reason why. They are amazing. These make my hair so incredibly soft um, even though, do you know what I mean, they're only 60p each. So if you do see some of those, they tend to be by the tills um, I've found recently, then grab yourself some if you suffer with dry coarse hair because they are amazing. What else have we got? What else have we got? I don't think there's much else in here that I've not shown. If you spot this little one in um, Aldi, this would make a great product as a little gift. This is their pink clay exfoliating face scrub. Um, I actually bought this for myself and then realised it's that close to Christmas now. I may as well just leave it and wrap it and put it in my stocking. Because um, I've already gone through two tubes of this and it is amazing. It is really... It's gentle, but it's really got quite a good scrub on it as well. I'm sure I'm missing things. I'm sure there's some of the big bits that I've bought that I wanted to show you, and now I can't think where they are because it's Christmas time when we stash things everywhere. Um, I'm going to leave this here because if I can't seem to find anything else, and I know I've been waffling on for a while now, so... If you enjoyed the video, I know it's a bit random, but I will try and link as much as possible down below all places I have bought things from so that you can maybe go and see if you can get them for yourselves in the description box. Um, so yeah, thank you for watching and I'll see you all tomorrow with my next video. Bye!